that's a beautiful Saturday here in Rosemount, Ohio, and I'm out here to do some maintenance on the flowers, and uh, got some weeds growing down in the other garden area, and uh, non-stop every weekend you gotta do something to maintain it. I have to thin out the lily pads soon, which means pulling them out of the pond. <clears throat> so this flower bed here, you don't have to weed too much. I got mint growing in there, filling in, and all kinds of different flowers. And I'm not too bad on this. Sometimes there'll be a tree growing in there. I'll have to jump up there and pull. Uh, let's go back here. So I tried to plant some wildflowers in with all these spider flowers and some of them came in. The orange ones came in. I was hoping for a little more collar this year, but uh, the ones that had different colors didn't really grow from seeds. I don't know what happened. So I carry on a tradition where when I was a little boy, my grandma and grandpa had a farm up near Columbus and had huge flower beds everywhere. And I'd help them pull weeds and do stuff, plant stuff, and they always had um, galvanized wash tubs, and uh, they called them wash tubs. So uh, when, I, when I bought this place and got married to Angie, I decided, well, I'm going to carry on the tradition and start flower beds and things. And one of the first things I did, I went to Tractor Supply, bought me a wash tub, and uh, use it for all kinds of stuff put the weeds in it so I can easily dump it in the bags and uh, on the farm grandma used to give me a bath and in, in this one of these wash tubs and so I never did give Garrett a bath in a wash tub but uh, yeah I picked this up at tractor supply and it also substitutes as an emergency fish tank for my pond if I need to take the fish out of the pond or anything. I can fill this with water and use it as a hospital tank. But yeah, there's a lot of weeds here on this section right here. Just non-stop battle with grass and weeds. And uh, way back in there, and down there especially, the nut sedge grass is a pain in my butt. Hopefully I can get some flowers growing down there, but uh, they don't seem to want to grow down there very well. But the, yeah, these orange flowers popped up out of like wildflower seeds that I just threw in there. So that turned out pretty good. And, uh, we're in the Soda River Valley where it joins with the Ohio River Valley down here. This is looking west. So y'all have a good day.